Carbon dioxide is a is cre created by an incomplete combustion of natural fuels such as fossil fuels, uh, diesel, wood, coal, petrol, biofuels, um, anything you'll find inside a house. Red, red blood cells travel around your body carrying oxygen. Carbon dioxide attaches itself to the red blood cells of your body. Therefore, it travels around your body, shutting down vital organs to your body. So like your brain, your heart, and other vital parts of your body. How does carbon dioxide go? I don't know. I think it stops breathing. But other than that, I couldn't give you a scientific definition. Solid fuel installer, for, for instance, uh, wood burning stoves, we have to give them an alarm. As I say, it's there for their well being and it has to be signed off to a heat hazard regulation. So, by giving them an alarm, it's something we have, vitally have to do. But uh, half the time, half the customers ask, Why do I have to have that? As I said before, you have to explain to them why they have to have it. It's like a smoke alarm. You need it, especially like after having a, so far recorded 47 deaths so far in a year. Typical sources of carbon dioxide appliances around the home are things like gas cookers, uh, gas ovens, wood burning stoves, uh, gas fires, your, your, your boiler for instance. Uh, anything you will use around the house which takes a fuel to uh, even oil burners, uh, uh, patio burners, even barbecues. The common symptoms of getting uh, carbon dioxide poisoning would be uh, headaches, uh, flu like symptoms, uh, sickness, vomiting, heart rate getting higher. Uh, if it's really bad, it will be uh, unconsciousness and therefore failure to the heart and uh, death. Tom was my son's friend from roughly the age of 11. Oh. Yeah, he's a lovely lad. He was a very nice person, very kind person. Unfortunately, he was a victim of carbon monoxide poisoning, um, which took his life in 2015. 